festivities for the CCAA Men's Volleyball Championships. Here about to witness the Mohawk Mountaineers face off against the Mountain Royal Cougars. Now, here are the starters and the non starters from each team, starting with the Mohawk Mountaineers. Here are the most dominant starters from the Mountaineers. We're at number three, Tom Benninger. Number 10, Norm Tosh. Number 11, Rene St. Amour. Number 12, Cody Force. Number 18, Cody Willis. Now for the starters from the Mountaineers. At power, number one, Adam Shield. At power, number six, Yasmin Cole. Welcome inside the Humber Athletic Center for the final gaze quadruple header of the CCAA Men's Volleyball Nationals here at Humber College. I'm Justin Ward alongside Joe Pogue. We're just listing off the starters for tonight's final match between Mohawk College and Mount Royal College out of Alberta. It's the ACAA champions versus the OCAA champions. The starting players for Mohawk College, Adam Scheidel. Number two, Sean Lowe. Number four, Steve Pavelchuk. Number five, Peter Snulis. Number six, the CCAA Player of the Year, Yasmin Cole, Kevin Watson, and number 13, Ian Cameron. Over out on the Mount Royal College side, we've got number one, Jay Blackano. Number four, Chris Webb. Number six, Levy Nutma. Number nine, Jason Garaco. Number 10, Patrick Lenor. The libero. Number 11, Tom Porto, Porta, rather, and number 13, Alan Meek. So a promising match between number one in Alberta versus number one in Alberta. But it's no wonder that these two teams are facing off against each other here in the semifinal match. Whoever wins this one will be going on to play for the gold. That they will, Justin, and what a game that we are coming off of the game between Briarcrest and UBC Okanagan. That game went into overtime right down to the wire, so the winner of this game will face Okanagan for the national championship tomorrow night. Okanagan sticking around, seeing who they will be playing. And tonight, as you were saying, we have tops in the country against the solo performer in the country in Yasmin Kull, as he goes up against the top team in the country, the Mount Royal College Cougars, coached by Sean Skye, James Bradley, the head bench boss for Mohawk. And both teams coming up underneath the fence now, or rather the net, to shake hands, say hello. After this, the friendly formalities are over as both teams have come to win, neither wanting to be eliminated from this gold medal match. Mount Royal, after playing the Humber Hawks yesterday, beating them here on their own turf. The Hawks having a tough time against that number one team and really defeating themselves by a few inconsistencies in their play. And the music is starting up here as both teams get ready to go. In the huddle still, it's Mohawk as Mount Royal looking a little more loose. Get Mo ready. Mohawk trying to continue their perfect unbeaten win tonight. Will put them into that national championship. 96.9 FM, Radio Humber. The CCAA Men's Volleyball Nationals here at Humber College. I'm Justin Ward here with Joe Pogue. Just about ready to get underway here. And Adam Sheedle will serve it in first for Mohawk. Both players look very alert and ready here. Nobody wanting con to concede that crucial first point. Sheedle up and over the net, and rather over the net, more like into the net. Not the way you want to start it off. And now. Mount Royal will take the serve. It'll be Chris Webb serving it in. Chris Webb up and over. That's put up by Scheidel. Done by Snulis. Pazelcheck puts it over. Barely keeping it in play there. Scheidel puts it up. Set again. And a nice tip there by Alan Meek. Rather, Ian Cameron, my mistake. So we're here to 1 1 in the first set of this match. Ian Cameron with 38 points this year for Mohawk. Mohawk serves it in. That's bumped up by Tom Porta. And a nice play there from the left side. Jason DeRocco gets it down 
on Mohawk. 2-1 now for Mount Royal here in the very early going of this match. Alan Meek now getting ready to serve it in for Mount Royal. Teams shifting around, Mount Royal getting their formation right. And Meek with a great serve, just tipping off the top of the net. That's bumped by Cull. Cull getting a great set there. And it's barely out of bounds. And we'll see if Cull shows up today for Mohawk. They need all the tools in the belt to beat this great Mount Royal team. Cull didn't serve very well yesterday, though. He sent, a, he sent quite a few of his serves into the net. Alan Meek serves it in again. That's bumped up by Sean Lowe. Bit of a broken play here, and a free ball is given over to Mount Royal. That's bumped up by Levy Nutma. Over on the right side, it's Patrick Lenore, but it's out of bounds. So Mohawk will take the serve. It'll be this 3-2 here for Mount Royal here in the first set. You're listening to the CCAA Men's Volleyball Nationals on 96.9 FM, Radio Humber. Out on the left side now, it's Patrick Lenore. Dug up, set by Snulis. Call right into the block. like Jay Blackano and Jason DeRocco now getting ready to serve for Mount Royal. Both teams staying fairly tight and the crowd as they are really feeling the anticipation here. That's down. Nice dig by Scheidel. Snulis puts it up. Cull turns a broken play into an attack and Mohawk takes the point. That's what having a quality player like Cull does for you. A broken play now a point for Mohawk and Cull goes back the record setter for all time aces here in the league. Let's see if he can pull one out now. Up and over, nice dig there by Mount Royal. Set by Black and a big spike from Levy Nutma. Set by Snulis, Cole comes up and drives it down. So that's two points in a row for Cole. And the crowd's going wild for him. The CCAA player of the year, strutting his stuff here at a national venue. 4-4 here in the first set between the Mount Royal Cougars and the Mohawk Mountaineers. Cull with a great serve. Nice dig there. Out of the barrel and Mohawk gets a block. Steve Pavelchuk slamming the door shut on Mount Royal. Great job by him. Cull going back now to serve again. Cull bouncing out the ball, sends the ball up high, jumps, spikes it, nice work, Nutma. Bumps it up, Black and O sets. Nutma goes for the spike. A weak shot into the block of Watson and Pavel's truck for Mohawk. But you know, when you get those weak shots, Joe, sometimes not what those blockers were expecting. Kind of just dribble off. Well, we saw Okanagan and Briarcrest last game do that to each other almost at will, and it really changed up the momentum. Lenore serves it in. A big play from Watson on the right with authority. And Mohawk really psyching themselves up here in the huddle. After that point, the Humber Athletic Center looking real pretty, filled with fans and done up for this national venue. Thank Doug Fox and Jim and his staff for that one. And Nutma for the left side with a spike. It's out of bounds, just barely. Mohawk takes the serve. It'll be Pavel Chuck. Pavel Chuck taking his time, throws it up and over. That's bumped by Duraco and a big play by Nutma there on the left side, right in between Scheidel and Cull, almost in the front court, just in the back there. And Mount Royal takes the serve, Jay Blackano. Blackano with one kill yesterday in the three games that he played, did not serve for an ace. Put up by Low, nice play there by Mohawk, who are really sticking with this Mount Royal team. There was lots of discussion by everybody here at the Nationals. Could Mohawk hang with Mount uh, with this Mount Royal team? And so far, the answer is yes. Watson serves from the back for Mo. That goes in, dug up by Mount Royal from the left side. A nice punch through by Alan Meek, and Alan Meek doing a great job there of putting it through the block of the Mohawk defenders. Mount Royal though, 